India got one singular nuclear bomb? The way we talk about them on the internet, I'm surprised they ain't let that hope go, bro. I'm not. What, what joke are you thinking of, bro? What joke, bro? What is it a stink that? bomb? <laughs> Yo, it's a bath bomb. Yo. <laughs> S X Y. And today we yeah. got. What if we don't? D- two. Oh my gosh, two in a row, bro. Bro, bro, it's a bad. Nah, day. you're nervous. I'm day. We got. What if we detonated all nuclear bombs at once? This is by my dog in a nutshell. Um, sure, check out my stuff. Not yo yo. Sure, check out Stanley's stuff. Stanley Live. Let's get straight into it, bro. Uh, that was, yeah. That, that was, was bad. That was, yeah, that, was that was horrendous, bro. That okay. was horrendous. Talk to me. Many of our viewers have asked us a very serious question. Talk what if me. we made a big pile of bombs and exploded every nuclear weapon in the world all at once? Okay. Who wants to know the answer to that question? I genuinely could care less about this answer. Like, who? I'm trying it's to figure out slow. what type of person it takes to actually think about this. Like, shocker. Yeah. yeah. Yo, it would explode. You're lying. Check it out. Yes. Like, bro. Like, whoa. No, like, no, like, you, you know might be onto like, something. Strangely enough, we couldn't find a good source to answer this question to our satisfaction. So, we gathered together a few scientists to calculate what would Talk happen. Me, One of them definitely North Korean. I was gonna say one of them Japanese. No, that they were on the receiving end. Type shit. Bro just lost two viewers off of that. That was Saddam Hussein <laughs> and Kim Jong-un, bro. <laughs> bro, they about to blow my shit yeah, up, nigga. Cap, bro. What the fuck? Bro, right here and go. Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Stop. 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 Answer to this extremely important scientific problem once and for all. Currently, there are 15,000 nuclear weapons on Earth. Good God. Wow. The US and Russia both have around 7,000. Well, f- like, why? why? Why don't you just need one? How many nuclear bombs do you think you're surviving? And I'm not saying in your area, like, if somebody drops it on you right now, it's on over. On top of me? Right, yeah. Or like. Like, but how much do you, like, let's say there's a w- war going on. How much do you think it would take until you're caught in one of the explosions? Like, luck wise. I think you know, like, we can it's going it to take right like 15. We can, we can test it out right now. I'm going to go to South Dakota. I'm, a, I'm, me, I'm, me home, Dakota. I'm hometown to the ground, man. Put me in Florida, man. Put you in Florida? Put me in Florida, Florida, man. South Dakota. All right. Talk to me. Oh, use your Siri. Say name a random state. Okay. Hey, Siri. Name a random state. Illinois. Illinois. We out of there. Okay. No. I think, how big does a nuke go? No, I don't feel like neither of us died. I don't think none of us died from that. I definitely feel, I definitely have three arms, though. Yeah, you, yeah, and a fourth eyebrow. Put me in Connecticut, bro. Okay, Connecticut? Yeah. Let me, let me get Nevada. Nevada? All right, bet. I'm going big states, bro. I'm not scared. Hey, Sarah, give me a random state. God damn! Yeah, dummy dead. Dummy dead. Your luck is ass. Wherever you're going to go for a nuclear bomb, I'm going the opposite direction. One more, one more, right, one, right, more, right, one, right. more one more, one more. Georgia! Georgia, Georgia, okay. Georgia. Let me go. I'm, I'm gonna go right in the middle, bro. Right in the middle, bro. Let's do Wichita, Kansas, bro. Hey Siri, give me a random state. Alabama. Where's Alabama? Holy oh my God! 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 Oh my God! You gotta, you gotta pray more. You gonna pray more at night, man. Your luck should not be that bad. France, China, the UK, Pakistan, India, Israel, and North Korea own around. India got one singular nuclear bomb. The way we talk about them on the internet, I'm surprised they ain't let that hope go, bro. I'm not. What what joke are you thinking of, bro? I don't think it's no joke. What joke, bro? What, it's a stink that. bomb. <laughs> Yo, it's a bath bomb. Yo. Round <laughs> 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 one thousand between them. But how much destructive power is this really? Let's try to put these numbers into perspective. Okay. I feel like I'm in school right now. No, great, they make great videos. On Earth, there are about 4,500 cities or urban areas with at least 100,000 inhabitants. Okay. Some are bigger than others, so we'll assume that on average, we need three nuclear bombs to completely wipe out one city. 
This means okay. we could destroy every single city on planet Earth with our nuclear arsenal, killing more than 3 billion people, roughly half of humanity, in an instant. And okay. we'd still have 1,500 nuclear weapons left. Like, literally, off that, that map that, alone, yeah. why do we have so many? Yeah, we literally can't even use all of them. Yeah. That's like buying five wallets and having one dollar. In my mind, I'm thinking it's on some, like, aliens attack. OD big ship. We Shooting send all of them to the aliens. Shooting yeah. at the ship. Yeah, at the ship. Isn't yeah. it crazy how every time we think of nukes, we think of shooting ourselves? Yeah. That's, like, bad, man. That's not self-hate. You know what I'm saying? I never thought about yeah, that. Yeah, it could be used for defense of all of us. You know what I'm saying? I never thought about that. Who knows if we're the only thing we fighting out here, man? Hmm. Hmm. You know now that's what an expert would call overkill. So we can say with confidence that we have a lot of nuclear weapons and they can do a lot of damage. But what if we make a huge pile of all 15,000 bombs and pull the trigger? Let's drop our nuclear pile in the middle of the Amazon rainforest, just okay. to show nature who's boss. Our warheads, piled haphazardly, fit into a small warehouse. A typical US warhead has the power of 200,000 tons of TNT. Good so 15,000 warheads would be the equivalent of 3 billion tons God. of TNT. For scale, this is enough to rebuild the whole island of Manhattan with every building and skyscraper using stacks of TNT. Oh, okay, the closest right. thing we can compare to the energy gathered here is a volcano. One of the deadliest volcanic eruptions in recorded history took place no, Tell Avatar and get on that mo. Avatar got cooked by that hoe. Actually, he did his thing. He did like you Roku know what I'm got. Roku got cooked. That's what. That that's what I said. I ain't gonna lie. Uh, that's what I said. Ang. He said he stopped that. Uh, that oh wait, no, he know. did. Yeah, he jumped in the air. He, he did, did this shit right here. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Come on. 1983 on the island of Krakatoa. The eruption was so powerful that 70% of the island and the surrounding archipelago was destroyed, killing tens of thousands of people. Its effects were felt around the world for days after the event. Our nuclear pile contains 15 times the energy of the Krakatoa volcanic hey, eruption. Wow. So let's finally wow. push the button. Three, two, one. Oh! In a second. Krakatoa. That's, that's what Squidward, Squidward said. Oh. That's what I was about to say too. Yeah, because I saw somebody yeah. say Krakatoa. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. 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 And a you. fireball 50 kilometers across vaporizes everything in its way and creates a blast wave that flattens 3,000 square kil Strong air burn. Yeah, kilometers okay. of forest. Every living thing within 200. And d d damn. Damn. Hey, he, he put up a fight though. Yeah, 50 kilometers will start to burn. The explosion will be heard literally around the world as the pressure wave circles the Earth tens of times over the next few weeks. Millions of tons of incinerated material are catapulted into the atmosphere. The mushroom cloud reaches the outer reaches of the stratosphere, pushing up against space itself. After things have calmed down, a small crater, about 10 kilometers across, is left in the center of the worst wildfires the planet has seen in millennia, spreading throughout South America, burning down forests and cities alike. And now, the unpleasant part begins. Extremely radioactive material yeah. will kill living things very quickly, and a large area several kilometers around the crater is now uninhabitable, as is everywhere for hundreds of kilometers downwind. This shit will give you superpowers? I swear, this shit will turn you into a Viltrum. Much of the fallout is carried high into the atmosphere by the mushroom cloud and carried around the planet. The amount of radioactive material in the environment doubles worldwide, which still is a portion of the particles will flow to the edge of space for years and cause a nuclear winter that could lower global temperatures by a few degrees for a few years. This exp Oh shit, we got 368? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the explosion was pretty bad saying, if you're in South America and especially Brazil. The Amazon rainforest that is pretty much history, which is not great, yeah. but human life will go on. Okay, but what if we explode more nuclear weapons? Let from where? From where? From where? Yeah. We literally what just took all of them. What base is working? We literally took all of them. Mm -hmm. Let's suppose humanity decided to mine every bit of uranium on Earth and build as many nuclear bombs as possible. At current usage, Nigga, they got Broly in there. That it's like estimated sure Superman got to worry about. <laughs> 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 there are around 35 million tons of uranium. Why did we? Why did we? Sense? That was. <laughs> that was crazy, bro. Bro, yeah, bro. that was yeah, bro. Be unique, man. Be, I was about to say be unique. I was literally yeah, about to say so. <laughs> in Earth's crust, enough to power human civilization for over two thousand. I'd become the Hulk if I got hit with that. No, you're not strong enough. You'd become like just mm. dead. Yeah, like, you'd like. <laughs>
You couldn't handle it. Nigga like me, though. Talk to me. Nigga like me, though. Right. Is that you know a, what I'm saying? Oh, that's you of like absorbing the shit. Absorbing the mm. shit. You know what I'm saying? That nigga, that nigga specifically dying. I agree. What you like? I yeah. actually think he gets like, what is the word? Disintegrated. Disintegrated. A sin. A sin no. A sin. Disintegrated. A sin. A sin. Eviscerated. Eviscerated. Wow, that was bad. Eviscerated. That, Appreciate that. That was untuck your chain. Thousand years, or to build millions of nuclear warheads. For the sake of argument, let's say we create a pile with a yield of 10 billion Hiroshima bombs. Damn! Which makes up a cube three kilometers high that okay. contains okay. roughly the energy of the asteroid impact that ended the age of the dinosaurs 65 million years. Once again, weak asteroid, ass, asteroid? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, dinosaurs are still weak for that in my right, opinion. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. Okay, two tons of flesh and muscle. Asteroid right that here. Shit killed you? Oh shit. Who? Throw that shit back, yeah. Like, shit? Literally. like literally, after. Oh! Catch a light. Like, Boom! I ain't nigga, gonna lie. What are you talking about? Yeah. Asteroid. Like these. Oh shit. Now. Oh! You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Home yeah. run type shit. Every time. Like, what is he talking about? Like, that's. That's like. That's just too easy. That's the too easy. Years ago. Except, it's also nuclear. Three. Two. One. Our pile explodes in a fire. That nigga didn't stand even the slightest of chances. <laughs> no, bro. All right, Small Fry, I appreciate you rating me, boy. Appreciate I, you, Small. Man, you know what I'm saying? Real nigga, that's a real nigga right there. Fireball stretching so crazy. high into the sky that it's visible from half of South America with so much power that the ground just... This nigga do not fuck with Brazilians, bro. At all. Why does it keep starting there? <laughs> there splashes like water, forming a crater 100 wow. kilometers across. Bedrock on the scale of whole mountain ranges is vaporized in an instant, while thousands of tons of material is catapulted away with such speed that it's ejected into space. Some leaves Earth forever, while most of it comes raining down as hot, burning debris that heats up the atmosphere to oven-like temperatures, killing most big animals and causing firestorms all over the world. The Earth's crust rings like a bell, struck by global earthquakes stronger than anything in recorded history. <laughs> watch this, watch this, bro. Yeah, literally, literally. Come on, no, watch Yeah, <laughs> hey, bro, come on, bro. Hey, this is doing too much, bro. I'd stop the explosion and direct it into space. That's what I'm like. That's what I'm like. That's what I'm like. That's what I'm like. I'm just like. Stop. <laughs> Decimating cities around the world while hurricane force winds flatten every single tree in South America and wildfires consume the continent. The abundance of hydrocarbons in the Amazon burn. Bro, this nigga makes amazing videos, bro. Yeah. These bitches are so cinematic, bro. To form ash are cast into the atmosphere, darting the sky and keeping sunlight from reaching the surface, dropping temperatures to near. Fr Good nigga, I could just sleep more, gang. Like, yeah, yeah. I, like, no school like, tomorrow, I guess. Like, yes, man, like, no work. Freezing like, niggas can't turn on a light, like, bro. Worldwide. The Sounds ensuing like it, global winter may last for decades and results in the extinction of every large animal species, humans included. They ain't talking about dogs, though. Yeah. 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 Hey, I didn't see a single goat on this list. Yeah. What? Yeah. what? Yeah. I didn't see Come a single on, goat. Man. Stop Come on, with me, bro. We could also mention that every corner of the planet is covered with radioactive fallout, but at this point, it doesn't matter that much anymore. This is humanity's extinction event. If a cockroach is surviving, I'm, I'm fine. surviving. Yeah. I'm I, fine. What? Well, you know how many bodies I done caught off roaches, bro. That's what I'm saying. Bro. That's the astronauts aboard the international. Space station get to enjoy a great view for a while, but it's not unlikely that the spray of rocks blast into orbit will destroy the station. Those lucky enough to be in bunkers or in submarines deep below the ocean surface may survive the longest before they exhaust their food supplies and have to venture out for more. They'll find the world a charred, freezing, radioactive wasteland. Good God. The planet itself doesn't care at all. After just a few million years, the wounds of the explosions have healed and life is thriving, arguably even more so than when humans were around. If intelligent life emerges again, it might be able to work out what happened. When they study geology, they'll find a bizarre and very thin layer of rock covering the entire world, enriched in radioactive elements like uranium and the other nasty things it decays to, mixed with rare earth metals and plastics that humans used. They would probably be very, very confused. 
I'm gonna be confused when well, I'm there to tell That's what no I'm saying. Yeah, man, I'm surviving no that. No if you think you're surviving the nuclear explosion, radioactive activities, or you're not exhaling, make sure you like the video. Make sure to search up Stan X Y instead of sexy, but sexy is the name of the channel S X Y, and we'll catch y'all on the next one. Follow Yo Yo on his stuff. And follow me on my stuff. We'll see y'all in the next one, man.